Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to enable Office 2016 automatic updates in Windows 10. So by default this setting should be enabled. However, if by some reason that an administrator or some kind of update messed up your Office product and you're not receiving automatic updates anymore, this tutorial is going to be for you guys. And even if you are receiving automatic updates and you might be concerned that you're not, um, this tutorial will show you whether or not you actually are receiving Office updates. So we're just going to jump right into it. So we can actually start by opening up any Office product. I'm going to select Word because that should be included with most bundled packages of Office. So I'm going to open that up. And then I'm going to go underneath a blank document here. Up at the top left, I want to left click on the File tab. And now on the left side, I want to left click on Account. On the far right here, we can see that it says this product will not be updated. If you left click on this little box that says Update Options, you see we have a few different options here. So we can either enable updates, view updates that we've already installed, and we can actually view more information about what updates are. And it really doesn't give you any information, obviously. So the only option that we're really concerned about here today is make sure you left click on Enable Updates which will automatically receive the latest updates for security, performance, and reliability. So if you left click on that, please know you have to be an administrator or have administrative privileges to continue. So left click on yes, and we see that the notification here has been changed to say updates for this product are ready to install, whereas if we disabled it again, we see that it changes to say this product will not be updated. So those are the two differences you guys have to keep in mind for this. So at that point, uh, once you've selected Enable Updates, it'll say Updates for this product are ready to install, and you should be good to go. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out, and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.